all I am trying to do is set the stage for wherein we are. At this moment, look no further than NVIDIA nowadays. To look how algorithms and excessive frequency traders are taking up the tape. The marketplace is taking flight. NVIDIA is down due to the sizable extent of zero dated alternatives. It's far seeing all proper. So if excessive valuation became your predominant fear, approximately a portion of the marketplace's mega cap, a month in the past, then VI's ahead. PE was 41 instances a month. In the past, these days, it's far 32.5 M become at 24.5 times a month ago. It's far now at 21.5 times these days. Apple is 29 years. Vintage Amazon was 38. Now, it is 31 alphabet, used to be 23.5. Now it's far 19.5. Microsoft is now 30 years vintage. I assume what I'm attempting to mention is that these stocks have extensively declined Jimmy. If the valuations were previously irrational, are they now greater affordable today? Barclays improves its technology. They switched to obese after a vast 16% decline. Given that July, Robson announced yesterday that he has subsequently, yes, for the first time purchased NVIDIA due to the inventory, steep decline in light of this fee correction. What need to? I do, yes. As I consider we must, as it should be, confer with it. Though I did not pay attention the whole lot, he said, the day gone by. I trust Robson who is shopping for is a exceptional example. Right here, he said, Appearance of direction, it could pass, decrease, from here. But if you look beyond the following month, and this is what I used to be pronouncing the second one, ago, and also you look to the end of the year, these valuations and those proportion fees are possibly to be better. We can't simply have a look at multiples in a vacuum. And there may be a very trustworthy reason behind this. The multiples have to be, as compared to the growth rate of profits, according to proportion. I see you no longer on your head as a growth investor. Carrie, you get precisely in which I'm coming from while determining if a saint is overpriced. The price to profits to boom ratio or PEG ratio is important. NVIDIA, possibly the most talked about inventory, has a PEG ratio below one. It has a 32 times a couple of going ahead and is growing its earnings in keeping with percentage within the mid 30s that may be a very desirable valuation for anybody acquainted with peg ratios i am aware that it could drop but i trust that from now until the end of the yrr it's going to reach a new all-time excessive but are there any indications that matters are transferring to a ways in the contrary direction as an instance micron is planning to start its buyback once more Nowadays, we are able to show the Micron chart. Are they appearing on this manner because the stock has dropped by using almost 30% inside the past month? Does it appearance better? Now become it overcorrected? You have to determine that, not me. But it nonetheless begs the query. Adam Parker, who became with me the previous day on asterisk, final bell asterisk, and is incidentally a former chip analyst at Bernstein earlier than shifting directly to different roles on the road, Remarked nicely, there may be been a variety of destruction. I want you to listen his thoughts on whether or not the semiconductor industry is currently appealing. During the last 25 years, I examined the 10 maximum latest downturns of 10% or more. I looked at which industries and the way equities frequently decline. And I idea nicely what has befell in this closing cycle due to the fact that July 16th, I sorted via the most important difference. And the semis are down in comper assessment to everything else. The semic cap gadget is down, more than traditional, all right? I will visit you, Joe. Are they attractive purchases? Yet again, Adam is normally right. If we're reading valuation and looking for semis, with lower valuations, I take a look at the names of the semis. Take a look at the system names, applied materials. 
Land Research, and KLA Corp. Regardless of having precise basics, they've all labored off full-size, excessive and intense bullish, if I may also use that term. What else do they possess? They've buyback authorizations, and we're approaching a time when we will reopen that buyback window. As you stated, it obviously presents a few support in precise situations for shares that you find exciting. But I'm not claiming it'll be the last spark that propels extraordinary appreciation that is crucial. So allow me to add some extra phrases proper away. Earlier, I mentioned the PEG ratio and the boom price of profits. According to Share What Takes Place, if the boom price is inaccurate, searching at the capital expenditure plans of groups like Google and Meta offers you a variety of reassurance that the increased costs are accurate in my opinion, whether it's NVIDIA chips or Micron's high bandwidth memory chips. They want processors to increase their eye efforts and that they have the financial sources to do so. They have got the cash flow to do it, but they are planning for years ahead of time in place of taking on greater debt or something else that is probably impacted by means of marketplace volatility. Consequently, for those increase fees are supported by using the fundamentals. While it comes, that's one manner. I would look at it and we were looking at it in case you look at the charts of a number of those, like ASNL and Broadcom. For instance, each of them are currently resting on a significant shifting average, the 100-day for Broadcom and the 200-day for SML. I accept as true with that, in case you maintain an eye fixed on these stocks over the next few days and nibble at them. If you do not already own them, you could purchase greater in the event that they set up levels of aid. Micron remains in a immediately down dive, and you don't know in which it's going to hold. Additionally, I agree with that. It's miles. Correct to mention that if you tally up the capital expenditures, which you anticipate the foremost agencies, which includes Google, Apple, and Amazon, are making on chips, you'll easily locate $2.00 billion from all of the big cap names, and that money have to go to someone. Therefore, the chip producers, mostly NVIDIA, but now not solely come first, followed by way of the equipment producers. Nicely, you're nonetheless positive about the marketplace as a whole. Following a week in which we get hold of guidance from ARM, Western Digital Intel, and Microchip. No, my bullishness is extra confined to agencies that assist NVIDIA or simply invest inside the GPU appearance on the Amazon convention call. They stated that NVIDIA is offered out, demonstrating their whole focus that they need to spend money on. I, for a totally long time, probably until 2025, they are bought out. Indeed, it hasn't deterred.